right here in the center of Vienna, Austria, a city which for centuries was the historical, political, cultural, religious, and economic capital of Europe, from it being the most populous city in the continent in the 19th and 18th centuries, to it being the center of the Habsburg dynasty, essentially the German imperial uh, royal house that was arguably the most powerful entity in world history. And this city, which is known for its major historic semblance, essentially displays much of its historic grandeur with this monument right here, St. Stephen's Cathedral. Essentially, this cathedral was first built as still a grand but much less opulent cathedral in the 1100s when the city was beginning to develop as the official archdiocese of the city or the central Catholic cathedral, the most important Catholic cathedral arguably. However, as the city began to develop and gain much more political and religious relevance throughout Europe, as the Dukes of Austria began to have much of their estates in much of the city proper of Vienna, the church had to be renovated to be much more grand and represent the increasing relevance and vitality of Vienna. Therefore, they did much of a limestone reconstruction, as can be seen with some of the blackening preface on the side here. And in the 1300s or 14th century, the Duke of Austria, Rudolf IV, basically uh, re renovated the cathedral and built it into the grand Gothic chalice that we essentially see today. Basically, it has much more of a Gothic as well as a bit of a neo-Gothic design or a medieval style on the outside and on the infrastructure and essential skeleton of the inside. However, the interior has much more of a Baroque sense or much more of a 17th and an 18th century artistic design as it has much more Baroque or contemporary frescoes. Some of the designs and inner decorations have more of a golden, more contemporary but still grand artistic sense to them. And in general, the city has much more, or this church example, exemplifies much of the city's artistic grandeur, especially with this cathedral. The exterior, however, is still more Gothic, and the inside has much more of a Baroque setting. In general, this cathedral is the most important cathedral, arguably, in Europe, and is definitely a major site of Vienna.